Hey everyone, it's Sarah Knutson from Overcome Everything. And today I want to talk to you about some information my colleague and friend Josh Burns recently told me about. And it's information that he found on boingboing.net. It's a really cool blog. Go there to check stuff out. But it's about crowdfunding. Now, if you're not familiar with crowdfunding, what crowdfunding is, it's the process of collecting micro donations from an online audience to fund your small project or small business. So if you're trying to get something off the ground and need funding, you can do uh, crowdfunding to do this. Okay, so as of right now, when someone funds these projects, they're, uh, they're funding with donations. They're not considered investments right now. So when you do this, uh, you know, when you do donate, you may get a gift in the mail, a CD, a t-shirt, something like that, but certainly you will not get a dividend check because it's not considered a legal investment if you will. It's a legal donation, but not a legal investment. Uh, but uh, according to boingboing.net, um, and as I record this right now, the Securities and Exchange Commission has been petitioned to allow crowdfunding investments up to $100. So this changes the game a little bit. So instead of donating $100 to these small projects and small businesses, you're actually investing in them. And if the SEC makes um, this requested change, it would have some really big impacts on investors. Now, investors, uh, what it would do is it would allow invest investors to be legitimate. You know, they would collect the dividend checks now. And also what it allows is people like you and me that we just want to invest a little here and a little there. We can do that and we can do that through crowdfunding. And what also is really cool is it allows the business owner or the person that's trying to get a project off the ground not have to uh, not to have to rely on the big businesses or um, excuse me the big banks or, or big time investors to get their their business off the ground. They can rely on people like you and me that uh, want to invest uh, a little bit here and there. Uh, it's really it, it could be really really powerful. Uh, for crowdfunding as a whole, for people like you and me, and um, you know, generally it would, uh, according to Boing Boing, it would decentralize a lot of the investment world and open doors to a whole new world of products. And this is really cool to think about products and services that normally wouldn't get off the ground because they wouldn't be funded. There would be no cash and capital to get off the ground. So it's really exciting. We do a lot of work in crowdfunding. It's one of the hot topics on the inter internet right now. And if you want to find out more either how to invest or how to get your project or small business funded, go to www.crowdfundingsecrets.com. That's www.crowd fundingsecrets.com. And that bark you heard in the background is my little beagle asking you to go out. So I'll talk to you later. Bye.